what's up guys i'm bhuv sher welcome back to a brand new video here on the channel now you guys know it's already april so today we once again have the 10 best android applications for the month of april for all of you guys so buckle up let's not waste any time and let's get started with the video All right guys so the first application on the list goes by the name of colorize and basically this is an application that lets you colorize black and white old photos automatically now it sounds like a gimmick but trust me when i say this the app does such a good job at doing this the perfect way let me just reduce the brightness so you guys can see the screen more clearly but honestly all you have to do is scan or upload a photo you can also import photos from your gallery for example let me just pick this photo over here and as you guys can see it just takes a moment to kick into that algorithm and get the colors but genuinely speaking look at this this is insane i mean the fact that it has done it automatically is absolutely crazy you can do this you can transfer your old memories into colored photos using this free application you can also save the photo uh, the app does require a pro subscription if you want to save multiple photos but honestly the free one works as well and i just showed you using the free version what you can do using the before and the after and i really feel like this is a great application so yeah definitely check it out link will be in the description below all right guys at number 2 we've got something called crunchy roll and this is basically a anime application that lets you watch the latest anime only one hour behind uh, the japanese television so over here at the home page you've got all the animes that you can watch here you can get a premium subscription uh, which just lets you get you know mega fans enjoy the newest episodes no ads and offline viewing but the free one works as well you can open any anime from here for example we've got naruto next generation so if we just click on it you can see uh, the different episodes that are there and start watching right from your phone i happen to know a lot of you guys watch anime and i recently uh, finished my first anime ever Actually, it was not recent. It's been quite a while, but but yeah, Death Note. I really, really enjoyed it. I'm trying to find more anime. I want to watch Attack on the Titans and uh, Tokyo Ghoul and all of that. So, if you have any more suggestions, drop them below. And for you guys, you can use this for all you anime enthusiasts out there. Definitely check it out. It will be linked below. All right, guys. At number three, we've got a self-help application called Healing Sounds. Now, Healing Sounds is basically your meditation, noise therapy, binaural beats, and all of these self-help apps all teamed. into one so this is one single application that lets you listen to binaural beats to basically let you sleep focus more it also lets you listen to solfeggio frequencies for anxiety relief instrument therapy noise therapy and lets you meditate as well using the application itself it has a built in section of a lot of guided meditations beats as well as a lot of other things and the best part about the application is that the ui is really really cool and there is also a courses section where you can browse through different courses i mean honestly speaking this is a great application and when it comes to the fact that it is a self help app i don't think any one of us should cheap out on that so the very fact that you're getting something like this for free is a very very good thing so definitely check this app out it will be linked below with that said guys at number 4 we've got an application called moises and this is basically uh, a very good application for anyone who is an instrumentalist or is in the realm of music so basically the app lets you break down different songs into their stem roots meaning if you go ahead and import any media url or any file from your you know online phone and take the audio of it what you can do from there is break that audio down into uh, the different sections for example you can see you can select a two track separation or a four track separation let's just sit on two track to keep things simple and you know it uploads the file separates the song into those two tracks for this it's going to be vocals plus instrumental and honestly i feel like this is absolutely insane considering the fact that you can do this on your phone and then you can also go ahead and uh, you know edit stuff like that now this uh, file is in queue and it takes several minutes but i'm just going to show you how the demo works so you basically click on it it's going to download the demo once it has downloaded as you guys can see you can increase and decrease the volume of the vocals drums and basically just create your own metronome increase uh, the playback speed as well and also increase the semitone so you can transpose the song into a different key which i think is really cool i mean 
If you understand half of the things that I'm talking about, chances are this is an application that will be of great help to you. So definitely check it out, link below. With that said guys, at number five, we've got one four wall and this is basically an application for all your cool wallpaper needs. I really happen to like the AMOLED section on this app, which is why this is the current home screen. So in case you guys had questions about where this wallpaper was from, you guys know where to look. Definitely check this application out. Other than AMOLED wallpapers, it's also got a lot of cool wallpaper you know themes and sections and you can also go to this area where it shows you new icon packs as well as klwp and kwgt presets that comes from the same developer i feel like this is really cool considering the fact that you know you can use all of this to customize your android and yeah the wallpaper i'm using is called amulet 063 so that's that definitely check it out it'll be linked below with that said guys the next application goes by the name of routinery and this is basically once again a productivity application that lets you set your own routine so what you can do is go ahead and add a new routine over here as you can see change the frequency change the type and the best part about this application is that it lets you have an analysis where it basically shows you your average performance throughout the week based on all the routines and the habits that you've had and also the streak days to keep you you know on schedule you also have a feedback section where you can record your feedback and this requires a seven day free trial after that it's three dollars monthly but honestly i am not using uh, the pro version or anything of that sort i just feel like even as a free app the application has a very good ui number one and number two a very good functionality for what it offers to do it can be your only productivity app that you use on a day-to-day -day basis so definitely check it out it will be linked below with that said guys next up we've got teo and teo is basically teal and orange filters for your android smartphone this is an application that has a lot of teal and orange filters or filters that borrow the teal and orange style for you to one tap and apply it on all your photos let me just show you if i open up a photo over here click on just once and click and go to any other photo for example let me just select a photo from my adobe lightroom folder and over here if i select any photo that i had clicked before that was added to my lightroom feed uh, let's just say this photo of the mountain range here you can see there are a lot of teal and orange filters over here that work really really well i mean for one tap edits this is absolutely insane you've also got an adjustment section where you can go ahead and increase the contrast the clarity and you know basically edit the photo a little bit but you're going to be using this application not for the editing tools but for this incredible filter scene and if you go to the stock application and the stock photo that they use for sampling i mean of course the photo has to be good but these filters are really really nice especially if you have some brown tones in it it really brings out that cinematic look if you will definitely check it out link below with that said guys next up we've got Yoda and Yoda is basically an application that shows you bite-sized information for you to keep learning every single day once you open up the app the first thing you have to do is choose a lot of topics that interest you for this test let's choose business science and technology general knowledge history and culture and lifestyle and of course current affairs then hit on start learning basically what the application is going to do is show you different articles if you will and if you can click on a single article what you have to do is swipe to the right and you will see any sort of information during that part you can like a particular article you can go to your own profile if you want to sign in you can also click on the plus button and sign in to post your own creatives if you want and i honestly feel like there's a lot of categories i mean if you want to keep learning getting new information this is a great application to try definitely check it out with that said guys next up we've got grasshopper and grasshopper is a free coding application now Full disclosure, I have no experience in coding whatsoever. So I'm going to be using this application for the first time. And if it is not difficult for me, I'm going to presume it's not difficult for any of you out there. So the first thing that the app does when you open it up is ask you how much experience you have. I have absolutely zero experience. Then we'll hit on next. Then it gives you a definition of what code is and how it works. Basically, then it also tells you about programming languages. And uh, then it asks you the purpose of why you want to code. I'm just curious. I'm going to hit on next. And there you go. This is your entire syllabus. We'll start with the fundamentals. Looks good. And you'll also get a official certificate which you can download and share. So let's hit on start coding. So over here, as you can see, the entire process is divided into tasks and you know, you can create something that you like. So what you have to do is create and start puzzles as well as solve them. So if we hit on start puzzle, the first thing we're going to do is draw box blue and uh, half the code is already here. Tap to get started. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is insert the code and then insert blue and let's run that. 
And as you can see, we've added another blue box here. This is super simple. My initial impressions, I think it's going to be great. It's going to be super simple. Definitely check it out. All right, guys, last but definitely not the least, we've got a game and this right here is Crazy Taxi. And I don't know about you guys, but I absolutely loved this game. I played the hell out of it when it was available on actual arcades. But even after that, I have been playing this game. And, you know, recently this game became free. It used to be paid on the Play Store. I remember because I really wanted to buy it, but I couldn't. But honestly, I feel like this is a great application. In case you guys haven't played this game, this is basically a game <laughs> where you select the driver of your choice. For example, I'm going to go with BD Joe here and uh, you have to pick up customers and drop them within the time limit but the map is absolutely insane everything moves very very fast and it's really cool it's basically a taxi simulator but you know with super cool rock music and uh, a fast-paced time clock which will force you to crash jump pop into different people and also you know just drive and make sure you get the customer there safely it's a great game i'm just gonna play a little bit of it so you guys can see what it looks like and uh, yeah let's do that okay i'm just crashing into everything now it's crazy and i really really like the music that they use because you know it's just great i mean it's super cool. I think we're almost there. So you can drift, you can do a lot of these crazy things. And yeah, it's a really cool game. Definitely, definitely check it out. We did it. And well, guys, that is pretty much it for today's video. If you guys did enjoy it, feel free to drop a like, subscribe to the channel. It really helps me and the algorithm. And uh, yeah, I wish to make these videos for you even more often. With that said, this is Anbuf signing out. I'll catch you guys next time. Until then, you guys have a great day. Stay safe. Peace out.